and we are working with people living with disability. We are helping them by teaching them the skills and then English, maths, some of uh, people who are living in community. And then we have the home-based group that they are helping them in their different homes. So then they are watch them, they take them to the clinics, and then they give them the pills in time of to take the pills. Yes, we have a beneficiary. We have a total number of 36 children that we are taking care, starting from the age of uh, 80 to 62. So these people, we collect them every day to the center. After 2 o'clock, then we take them back to their, res their respective homes. But then we teach them also uh, how to learn, how to talk the speech, and then pottery, carpentry, sewing. So now we've got the biggest challenge. Our building now is not functioning. So the problem is we have a lot of breakings. They have stole all the pipes for the water. We have electricity problem also. So I think that's the big challenges that we have at the center at this moment. Yes, it is so important because look, there are other people that they don't care for their families, especially for these children who are living with disability or the adult that is living with disability. They are living with a special needs of which we have to take care of them, even if though their parents now they have lost their work, so then we still take care of them. So that's why they are so important to us. So we have to, we are able to help them, in fact. My passion is to see that the organization growing and then going to the community, help the community, and then all the community's members, they should know about our center, how we're working, and then we have to get the results and the impact of what we are doing. Are they getting a progress? So are they changing now and then? Because some of them now, they are able to do themselves, so they have recovery. Yeah, so you don't know personally me as a, the manager. I don't want money, even if there will be someone that can say, look, guys, I've got the pipe, or someone who can assist you to install uh, the toilets, water, electricity, then it will be fine for me, because some of other stuff, I can do it in my own without asking any money. By making a donation, or even just by sharing their story, you can help make a change.